We've got tips and recipes for healthy living. So for fun and inspiration, come and join us in the raw food world. Welcome everybody, this is Matt Monarch with the Raw Food World TV show and today is April 5th. And it is Sunday, our last full day here in Vilcabamba, Ecuador. And we are on our way to go see Michelle, who's a 100% raw foodist, who supposedly is really good with creating food forests and stuff like that. Yeah, we want to go look at his food forest and get some ideas and maybe have Michelle help in creating one for us, right? Yeah! Mm -hmm. Let's take this adventure by storm! Yeah. Bum, 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 bum. Apparently he has three children he's raising raw as well. Wow. This should be fun. We drove like a mass amount of kilometers here through bumpy roads and everything. He's like seriously living in the wilderness here. It's awesome. So we'll see you in a moment. People living in the wilderness here. Yeehaw. I'm thinking of jumping. This road is a river. It is. We are walking upstream in a river. <laughs> By mistake. Bump, bump, ba da dum, psh, bump, da da dun, psh, dun, da da dun, psh, dun, da da dun. In the night, there's calm, and the land is dark, and the moon is the only light we'll see. Ba -da -bum, bum. No, I won't be afraid. No, I won't shed a tear Just as long as you stand Stand by me So darling, darling, stand by me Whoa, stand by me Oh, stand me Stand by me, stand by me. Well, darling, darling, stand by me. Nah. Okay. Crossing more rivers in the wilderness to get to Michelle's, the raw food family. Da 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 Some pieces are really beautiful, like this is really, really white. Me keep this one? Sure. Angela Stokes has more rocks than any other person on the planet. Not say rocks. Not say stones. Pretty crystals. Pretty crystals. <clears throat> It's kind of scary going into a rock shop, a crystal shop, because I know what's going to happen. Nah. Not say rocks. Holy. Hello? Hi. I was just walking and I found you here. That's kind of scary. Is that a bull? Probably. It's a wild bull. 
go. Oh, then go until, until you hit, you hit the, the house. Okay. Hi there. Do you just live right here? I guess so. Is this your chair, Maya? I feel like I'm in like a Star Wars movie or Willow or something, and there's like creatures everywhere making weird noises. Dun 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 dun. dun. Bum ba dum bum bum ba dum bum 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 bum. A bit more. We're in the forest. Oh, we could check in. And loving it. <laughs> Bye, Mr. Bull. Well, we're gonna check in here. Bum ba dum bum. <laughs> bum ba dum. <laughs> bum ba dum bum. <laughs> dun 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 dun. No, nah. there's a house. There's human gardens. This is it. We're about to meet the raw food eaters, Michelle. Wow. See any raw food eaters in the woods here? Talk about living in the wild and doing it the wild way. Oh man. This is incredible. Homeschooling classroom. Homeschooling. Is it? Yeah, look. This Check out this, this structure. It's just beautiful. <clears throat> All the materials probably come off the land here for the. Okay. This is as wild as it gets. A lot of effort has been put into this place. I mean, I feel this is like the goal of every man is to make his home domain like this. When I'm on my land, this is all I'm all, I'm all about this. Making it a paradise. Absolutely. There's a lot of work been done here. Yeah, it looks like we turned too early. All these rock walls. And Adobe on top. Yeah. Amazing. All right. We didn't uh, quite make it to Michelle yet. I think we came to the lower portion of his land. And we're going back to the road. When you're living in Ecuador, you don't exercise. Exercise just happens. You don't go to the gym. You don't go to a yoga class. You're just out in nature all the time. Getting natural exercise. Even on your own land. Mm -hmm. I've had so much exercise. We'll call it playing. It's unbelievable. Yeehaw! One more time. <laughs> you take the low road and I'll take the high. I'll be Michelle's before you And all of our raw food friends will come and join us here In Vilcabamba in June 2010 Vilcabamba, Ecuador, June 2010 The Raw Food World Conference I think this is a sign that we're about to meet the 100% raw foodist living wild, Michelle and his family. In the depths of the jungle. In the depths of the jungle. In Ecuador. Ah! Thanks for joining us. We'll see you again at the Raw Food World.